Again. A big change in another school district could affect who's watching out for your child's safety. Lacey Chris live in Waukesha to tell us about a school bus shakeup. Lacey. The Waukesha School District has decided to use a new busing company for next school year, which means your child could be in the hands of a new driver and more than 100 drivers could be out of a job. I would hope that the bus companies do background checks on these people and that whoever is driving the bus is a safe person. For decades, the Waukesha School District used Dairyland Bus Incorporated to get students to and from school, but that will change this fall. The district has decided to move on with a new company, and that means your child may not have the same driver they've had for years. The transition period is going to be probably the biggest situation, uh, getting used to a, a different company, a different bus driver. First student was slightly cheaper, will use mostly propane gas, and will install GPS tracking devices, cameras, and a card swipe technology so parents will know when their child is on the bus. It will also allow the district to change routes to become more efficient. It's a way of, of uh, tracking the movement of students, uh, the frequency of use of the bus. Without the contract, Dairyland has told the state it will lay off 155 workers starting in June. But school board president Daniel Warren hopes your child will still have the same driver next year. My hope uh, would be, and my expectation would be, is that many of the drivers uh, that are currently employed by Dairyland uh, will qualify and become drivers for first student. First student tells me about half of Dairyland's drivers have already applied, which puts these parents at ease. I think that's cool that parents can know that their children made it on the bus safely. And first student tells me they will be holding open houses so the current bus drivers can apply for jobs. On your side, live in Waukesha, Lacey Crisp, today's TMJ4. Lacey, thank you very much. So one measure of justice.